Hey there lads and ladies, it is Petrifying Pumpkins here and I am back yet again with a Firewall Zero Hour news update, the very first one since the game has in fact launched. So I'm sure many of you are playing this game now, many of you are having a good time, I myself am loving it and I will have a review at some point but right now I'm so early into the game I'm still only like level 10, there's so much more to be unlocked. I think I may need to put in like 30 or 40 hours before I feel comfortable doing a review on this game but it hasn't all been smooth sailing now there has been some issues in particular matchmaking issues and host issues so I'm sure if you're like me you've probably experienced where you come together with your friends you group up in a squad of four and then you try and join a public match and then something happens you get an error message get split up or maybe some of your team goes on to the enemy side or then there could be other times when you're in a match and then whoever the host is leaves and then everyone gets kicked so that's a, like a, another issue that what people are having including myself but first contact have recently taken to Twitter and they've updated their own blog to address these issues and talk to the community about what's happening in regards to fixing those issues. So I'm just going to read it out here, I'm going to have the source in the description and they've been reading our comments, they've been listening to our feedback, they've even joined my streams and we've been talking to them so we've heard some of this from them from the horse's mouths as it was but in this particular thing they're addressing these two issues now I know there's other things that people want there's things like three rounds instead of just one round and stuff like that but I think they're really just prioritizing the basics because these, these are fixes those other things are kind of like additions you know so the first thing is setting up a squad with squad mates so they say here that they are aware that sometimes friends are placed on separate teams once in the lobby we are evaluating and improving squad handling and understand that people want to play public contract mode with friends to earn XP now they say that because it is possible it's like it's much easier to uh, play with friends in private matches for some reason it seems like a much easier time to get everyone together but once you go public that's when the issues come in they're looking at it they're working on it right now then the second thing to talk about is host performance so they say here that they currently use a peer-to-peer -peer format so please be aware that it is possible that quitting early may affect everyone else's game we are working on improved in-game messaging and a way to protect the loss of progression ie crypto and xp for players when this happens now i have seen people react to that second one already that they're not happy they think that just getting the crypto crypto and the XP isn't enough and that they want maybe something like a host migration or dedicated servers or whatever. Instead, I, I hope myself that host migration is something that does appear at some point. I don't know how difficult that is to implement in a game, but this is at least a start. They're definitely listening. This is what they're working on right now. Hopefully in the future, they'll keep expanding, keep solidifying the structure that they have in place there and improving upon it. And they end the blog post here with like thanking everyone for the great response, of course, and they really want you to know that they're listening to feedback, so keep giving your feedback. They want to hear that. They, they're very interactive with the community, even though they're very involved, which is great to see. And I hope before long we will see that first patch that really improves the, uh, the matchmaking. So guys, that is it for this video. Just a quick little update about a lot of the issues people are complaining about. I see a lot of people saying this in the comments and stuff like that as well. Now, I am getting a lot of entries as well. I just want to point out for the top 10 plays. I'm, well, I'm pretty sure it's going to be a top 10 plays at this point because I'm getting a bunch of entries. A lot of you are submitting stuff and I thank you very much for that. It's going to be very cool. Once I get time to do it, I might leave it a week before I start working on it so that, you know, everyone's had a week to play it and then they can submit their stuff. But I would just like to reiterate that if you could please I can only accept like the shorter clips if you're sending me in big long videos I just don't have the time to like download that whole thing and then search for that part and then cut it and all that kind of stuff so if you can just send me the actual specific moment that would be a big help and also I might do like an early impressions video soon hopefully and then later on a proper review in between the constant streams that I'm doing right now and thank you all so much for watching those streams by the way and commenting and stuff like that it's been fantastic so far the growth has been cool i've already passed 900 now it's gone crazy i didn't even get to celebrate the 800 you know this is this is mad so thank you very much for watching lads and ladies if you like this and what else please consider doing all the usual shies i'd appreciate that very much and i'll see you in the next one bye bye